look at some of the statistics, we know 38% of principals say they will not stay in the position after three years. This means we have to find new ways to retain and recruit uh, our principals. We have a crisis in that so many principals are turning over and they're turning over in the schools with large populations of black and brown children, poor children, underserved children, children that come from families that have been marginalized for generations. So there's so much work to do in the recruitment and retention area. First, I would say they have to really focus on the social emotional needs of our teachers and staff and COVID-19 really brought that to the forefront, that while we're pushing to mitigate learning loss and to close achievement gaps, individuals are going through their own personal issues that are sometimes even debilitating. And we have to support teachers and staff in that area. So I think creating new models where you can retain a teacher, but also grow their leadership or allow them to do some other things within uh, their responsibility Abilities or even outside of their responsibilities will help us keep great folks in the field. The Guilford Aspiring Leadership Program has three main goals. One, just to develop great leaders within the current context what schools are experiencing, what students are experiencing, what school districts are experiencing. The next is to make sure we develop transformational leaders who address inequities and structural racism. And they, these leaders are the ones who will go and make sure that students' lives are transformed forever, not just improve test scores, but actually transform the lives of the students that we serve. And then we are creating strong pipelines. How do we create a pipeline for and by staff of color so that there is representation across the district uh, for students to see of uh, people who look like them in leadership positions and that we are providing access for people of color to actually be promoted and to serve their communities in a leadership capacity.